It's time for number three on your study guide. We're looking here at selecting the expressions that are equal to this madness of an expression here, uh, which ones are the same as. So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start off by uh, simplifying it to its fewest terms, and then that should help me determine which ones are true. So I'm going to go ahead and copy this bad boy down. And my suggestion to my students is to go through and make all of the minuses into additions of their opposites. So negative 5x doesn't get changed, plus 2 does not get changed, but when this minus right here becomes a plus, we add the opposite of what follows. Now the opposite of what follows is a group, so we have to make this entire group its opposite. And the opposite of 12x is negative 12x, and the opposite of take away 3 is add 3. So that 3 is positive, which really eliminates some of your choices here. Uh, this one has 3 being takeaway, so it can't be A. This one right here has 3 being takeaway, so it can't be D. So we just, now this one has takeaway negative 3. We'll come back to that here in a second. But takeaway 3, that's not going to happen. It's going to end up being a positive 3. Just that alone eliminated A and D. Uh, and now we, we put our like stuff together. You know, we put our 5x and our negative 12x together. Uh, we put our 2 with our 3, and we combine our like terms. You know, negative 5 and negative 12 add to make negative 17x, and 2 plus 3 make 5. So we're looking for negative 17x plus 5, so we know that C is correct. Um, and then these other two that are involved could possibly be true, because if you look a little closer at B, it's the exact same thing that I have written right here. So that means that B is equivalent. It says select all that are equal. B is the same as C. It's just been simplified. Uh, and if you look at E, E's kind of a little tricky. Notice that we have a negative 5x, like we should, okay, like we do over here. We have a positive 2, like we should. We have a negative 12x, like we should, right? And we have a takeaway negative 3. Now, this is the tricky part. Take away negative 3 is just the same as adding a positive 3. Add the opposite rule. So really, E is just another way that we could re represent negative 17x plus 5. It is also equivalent. So our selections for study guide number 3, you should select B, C, and E because they are all equal to the original expression that was given here.